Hey you guys, it's your girl T. So I want to come on here and talk about this video that's going viral. It's causing a lot of controversy online. So what's going on is that basically this takes place down in Arkansas. It happened at North Little Rock High School. And it's between the teacher and the student. What happened is that this student, he's 18 years old, they're not releasing his name, but basically he had gotten in trouble in this classroom several times before for cheating and other things. So right now, you know, all the kids were doing finals. This took place on December 17th during finals. And this was in his science classroom. So the science teacher told him that he would have to take his exams in the hallway where he couldn't be around the other kids and, you know, either punk them or, you know, get answers for them or whatever. So the kid refused to go out in the hallway. He said, I'm not going out there to take a test. I'm taking my test in here. The teacher goes to try and call security on the intercom. The student gets up and gets up in the teacher's face and says, I dare you to hit that intercom button. You better not hit that button. So the teacher goes ahead and he hits the damn button like he's supposed to do okay how you doing so he hits the button so then the student goes back and he sits at his desk so while the teacher is filling out a slip to write him up all of a sudden he hears all this commotion so once the teacher goes to investigate what's going on he sees that the student has lit up a cigarette so the student's sitting there smoking in the classroom lighting up a cigarette the teacher tells him to put it out the student then gets up he gets up in the teacher's face and he blows smoke in his face not once but three times and some of it was caught on camera i want you guys to go ahead and check out this viral video really quick and i'm gonna come back with the rest of my commentary <laughs> you guys just saw that video so initially when this video went viral um the school system had not done anything the student hadn't been suspended nothing had happened to him now that the video has gone viral the police in arkansas are stepping up they're trying to charge him with criminal charges of course it's not a felony or anything like that i think it's just like a misdemeanor but a lot of people are screaming foul they're saying well you know what he didn't beat up the teacher how dare they try and make this criminal they're only trying to make this criminal because he's a black student first of all i don't feel bad for that student whatsoever Cool Kudos to the teacher for basically having enough patience and standing there and taking that abuse. That is disgusting. The average adult on the street had a kid come up to the average adult on the street and blown smoke in their face. That kid probably would have gotten knocked out cold. So the fact that the, that the teacher stood there and took it, didn't hit him, didn't cuss him out, you know, stayed professional. I give that teacher all the kudos in the world. I don't feel bad for this kid getting charged. You know what I'm saying? If they want to charge him with assault, they have a right to do so. One, he had no business sparking up in the class classroom he had no business disrupting the classroom and then blowing smoke in the teacher's face granted he didn't hit the teacher but that's no different than you know intimidating somebody or threatening to do something to them so I don't feel bad for him at all I just get tired of everything being tied to racism at the end of the day he was acting like an asshole and he put himself in that position the problem is you have way too many kids out here who do not have any respect for adults they don't have respect for authority figures and you can't tell them anything with him being 18 years old if anything he needed that science credit because he needs to get the hell up out of high school with his grown ass you know what I mean? So if anything, he should have took the situation even more seriously than the other students. So I just find the whole situation crazy, but I don't feel bad for him if they're going to charge him with charges. At the end of the day, he's probably not going to be charged with nothing more than a misdemeanor assault charge. They'll probably give him a slap on the wrist and make him pay a fine. People are acting like he's being charged with a felony and he's looking at 20 years in prison. That's not what the charge is about, but they just feel like being that the school didn't do anything to discipline him and being that the school did not suspend him, the police department are not feeling like they want to get involved and basically give him a criminal no charge behind his actions and I just don't feel bad for him we have too many students out here who want to learn something and they don't deserve to have their learning environment disrupted because this young man has no emotional self-control so anyways let's go ahead and get the discussion popping go ahead and leave a comment how do you guys feel about this situation that went down in Arkansas do you feel like he should have criminal charges brought up against him and then how do you feel about the teacher you know standing his ground you know holding his composure and not allowing that student to put him in a predict that could have gotten him fired from his job let's go ahead and get the discussion popping go ahead and leave a comment all right deuces hey you guys it's your girl t make sure to subscribe like and share my videos you can also visit lovelytea.com to purchase any merchandise also don't forget to click the boxes down below to watch any of my previous videos talk to y'all later deuces